A new video from Chinese Air Force demonstrates two of the latest Chinese missiles, the KD-88 air-to-surface missile and the YJ-83K anti-ship missile, both carried by the JH-7 fighter bomber. In the video the latest variant of JH-7 aircraft practiced a few types of weapons, including bombs, rockets, and of course the missiles. The new model, called the JH-7A, is one of the less advanced fighter bomber currently in service, but with its capacity controlling latest generation air-to-surface missiles, it is still a key player in Chinese Air Force and Navy. The JH-7A can carry up to four YJ-83K or KD-88K missiles, but in most cases only two of them, plus fuel tanks, short-range air-to-air missile, possibly a data transmission pod, and an electronic countermeasure pod. The YJ-83K is a subsonic anti-ship missile can fly around 200 km at very low altitude to avoid enemy defense. It has an active radar seeker. The KD-88 missile is an air-to-surface missile with imaging guidance technology and packed with satellite positioning correction equipment. The JH-7A is quite often carrying a KG-600 jamming pods. It can work with LD-10 and YJ-91 anti-radiation missile designed to destroy enemy radar. The Chinese military also operates J-16D and J-15D carrying these two types of advanced missiles. The JH-7 was using imported British Rolls-Royce Spey 202 turbofan engines initially, later switched to domestically produced version. The aircraft has a Type 243 radar capable of detecting large warships, but not suitable targeting land objects. Around 2000s, the JL-10A Condor Pulse Doppler Multimode Radar is added to upgraded JH-7 fighter bomber and modernized avionics including two LCD cockpit displays. The radar offers low-altitude terrain following capability and can search or track land targets. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please subscribe, share and comment. It will really help us developing this channel and bring you more videos about Chinese military news. Thank you.